Hey guys, back with another video. My name is Peter Pan, and I approve of this message. So, uh, if you've been uh, visiting my channel, my YouTube channel lately, maybe you, uh, you noticed uh, that, uh, well, first of all, I haven't uploaded a video in a week, week and a half, two weeks, I don't know. Anyway. Uh, I've gotten a few more um, subscribers on the channel. I think I'm up to, I don't know, Google Analytics shows one thing and other apps shows different things. So it's either 117 or 130 or something. Um, I think, I think uh, Google uh, or YouTube Analytics is uh, checking every uh, subscriber to the channel uh, to make sure that uh, to make sure that that there aren't any uh, fake followers fake uh, subscribers like bots and stuff like that so i guess they have to do that uh, because when you when you get to monetize the channel it's gonna cost them money but at the same time, it's also going to make the money. So, yeah. Anyway. Uh, <clears throat> I had... Uh, I've done two uh, live live stream. I call it... I call it... Um, subscriber streams. I couldn't find, come up with anything else. So, uh, sounded good. So, subscriber streams. So, I did the first... Uh, subscriber stream on youtube and uh I, s I streamed for 25 hours and 41 minutes and um i was doing a lot of uh a lot of uh social media work and uh, sharing uh, information about my youtube channel and stuff like that so i was actually doing quite a bit of work and I also started a new website. Maybe you, maybe you've seen that now. It's uh, Robert Olson Creator dot com. So every time I upload uh, a video, and uh, every time I publish a new podcast, I'm gonna try to remember to uh, publish it to the website so that uh, you can go into. Uh, robertolsoncreator.com and uh, so if you go to the website and uh, you sign up as a, a follower of the website or follow the newsletter I don't have any access to uh, the whole website is uh, run through WordPress so I don't have any access to anyone anybody who signs up I just get a message if someone signs up but uh, with a username and uh, a link to their website if they have a website on WordPress. So I can't personally send anyone an uh, email, uh, or uh, it it goes it goes out automatically when I uh, add a new uh, add a new uh, news feed or something to uh, my WordPress website. So uh, if you sign up there, you're completely safe. I'm not going to be able to get your email. Uh, I don't think I can. Could be, maybe. Well, anyway, if you go in there, uh, you can add it to your bookmark and uh, visit the website every day and you always be updated. I'm just gonna adjust camera here. So yeah, um, oh yeah, I've also, the second stream is uh, still ongoing and uh, I've actually created a Twitch account. Yeah, this old mother. Ucker is is now a streamer. I haven't streamed any game gaming videos, and I'm not sure if I ever will. Um, yeah, because I'm actually thinking about selling my my gaming computer, gaming laptop, because I need money. Yeah. Right now my car is uh, parked up in a parking uh, parking space there with a completely flat battery you can't even jump start it with the 
with a car that has a, a bit smaller battery because it doesn't have enough uh, power even if the car is even if the other car uh, that you're jump starting with is running you're not gonna make get it running so uh, I have to get a new battery uh, and it has to be a big battery because it's a diesel shit so uh, yeah and I started to uh, um, try and get my bike started uh, the other day uh, I think, think yeah, that was the last video I, I uploaded, uh, I don't know, a week or a week and a half or something ago. And it was a pretty failed attempt at starting the bike. Uh, if you see in the video, uh, you can see that the uh, choke, well, it appears to have, uh, the cable appears to have frozen completely. But uh, the cable wasn't the problem because uh, I added some oil and uh, stuff to the cable and... Uh, the day after uh, I noticed the problem, I went back to try and uh, to move the, the choke lever and I was determined to get it moving because I really wanted to, because uh, the weather is pretty nice, a little cold but uh, dry and stuff so I really wanted to take the bike out for a ride. So I got a little rough with the choke lever and uh, the choke cable. Uh, uh, snapped so uh, the bike has uh, two carburetors so it's got two cylinders so it's got a it's got a v-twin engine and uh, it's got a, a separate carburetor for each cylinder so it's a cable when it when the cable goes down under the fuel tank it splits and it one part goes to the front carb and the other to the to the rear carb so um, I've ordered a new choke cable, it was like $15 or something from uh, eBay, I can't remember. And now I'm completely broke. Uh, I don't have money, even if I got the bike started now, I don't have money for gas. Uh, so I'm gonna have to sell my beloved gaming computer. So. Uh, when I do that, um, I can get a new battery for for the car, so at least I get that running and uh, fix my bike so that so I can start it. And also, depending on uh, I have some bills I have to pay too, so depending on how much money I have left, maybe I can buy a a second hand uh, camera that I can use. Um, instead of using my uh, uh my iphone and uh so i've been looking at a few cameras but uh i really want the the dj osmo pocket and even though i've pledged my heart's content to the world dji hasn't reached out to me yet <laughs> poor me <laughs> Yeah, anyway, uh, the second stream uh, is ongoing right now and uh, it's going on uh, on uh, my Twitch account. And it's just called uh, YouTube Subscriber Stream. Well, that's the stream. Uh, um, and I've added some links to... Uh, <coughs> I've added some links to... Uh, Instagram and uh, Twitter, Facebook. I got one follower on my Twitch account uh, during the night, so I uh, I don't have any new. Uh, I don't think. Uh, well, this this says 117 subscribers on YouTube. But anyway, I only have one subscriber uh, or follower on my Twitch account, and uh, that's someone who. Uh, Followed me during the night because of the stupid uh, stream I'm doing here with uh, PewDiePie! Guys, check out my new favorite channel. It is so good. Oh my god. Look at it. Oh yeah, I got a uh, username custom URL on, uh, on YouTube. 
Maybe you can see that there, youtube.be slash c slash Robert Olsen vlog. DO IT! So, that's a little bit easier to, uh, a little bit easier to remember uh, my, uh, my channel uh, uh, address. So, now you can actually, if you don't have a memory of a goldfish, you can actually remember the, the URL and just type it in. And it's pretty, uh, if you check out uh, the weather outside here, it's pretty windy outside. And um, it's mid, mid February, so it should be pretty cold right now. Probably around zero degrees and maybe a little snow, but actually it's, it's over seven degrees outside. So it's pretty warm, it's, it's like this warm wind that's coming in um, and I can see from the sky here that uh, there's a lot of rain coming in from the southern part right there. So it's gonna start raining uh, pretty well. Yeah, so maybe you can see the trees moving around it's kind of quiet now but it was really blowing uh, earlier today earlier i actually just woke up and it's like i don't know three o'clock yeah <laughs> i've been working on uh, setting up the graphics and stuff uh, for the twitch stream that I started uh, last night and uh, I have actually been streaming live on Twitch now for uh, 16 hours and 11 minutes so uh, the YouTube stream I did uh, that was 25 hours and 40 minutes and um, when you upload a video to YouTube, usually uh, when if you have pretty fast internet connection, the upload uh, is usually pretty fast. But what takes time, especially if you have uh, if you have some big files, even though the upload uh, is pretty quick, um, YouTube's processing of the video. Yes, YouTube does uh, processing, it does a lot of it. And uh, maybe you heard the people complain about the... Uh, maybe you heard the people complain about the YouTube uh, compression and that's it. Uh, they're actually... They're actually compressing the videos uh, compressing the audio and they're also running a and they're also running a uh, content ID search on the video and on the audio content of the video so uh, if they find any if they find any um, copyright issues with the video, it's going to get flagged uh, automatically. And um, I saw on YouTube uh, yesterday, um, Linus uh, Tech Tips. Well, you probably know Linus, Linus Media Group. Well, some of his uh, fellow YouTubers have gotten uh, copyright claim claim or copyright id uh on some of the videos uh, i didn't get uh, too much info on uh, on the details but uh, he tried to explain it as well as he could and uh, uh, he was reading uh, a post from uh, a user on his uh, discussion forum who explained it pretty well and uh, he said that if you get a copyright uh, copyright claim 
claim ID. I've gotten one and that was uh, um, from a video I did. I was filming outside on the, on the deck and I was doing a, a I can't remember, time-lapse video or something using my iPhone. And I've uh, I edited the video using LumaFusion on my iPad. And uh, I added uh, background music from Storyblocks, which I had a subscription for. And the music from Storyblocks got copyright claimed. So I was kind of mad uh, when that happened. But all I had to do was uh, file a dispute against the claim. And uh, it took, I don't know, two days or something. And... Uh, the claim was removed and uh, it's no problem. When you get a copyright claim, there's no really problem uh, against you or, or your channel. But if you get a copyright strike, then they will take the video down. And if you get three copyright strikes, your whole channel gets, uh, gets removed. So um, certain large companies, they get special access to YouTube to be able to uh, to manually uh, add uh, copyright strikes to other people's channels. And I don't know if you uh, heard about uh, The Verge and Vox Media. Now, let's talk about The Verge and their massive, massive oopsie. Been a lot of drama on, uh, on YouTube uh, the past week, actually. Uh, right now, I'm just gonna have me some snuff and uh, drink some coffee and do some editing um, maybe I'm not sure but maybe I'll uh, do a podcast later tonight so I'll probably have it uploaded uh, later tonight if I get a chance to do it because I've got a lot of stuff to do with uh, with the YouTube channel and uh, uh, trying to get my head around Twitch because uh, this is the second time I'm actually logged into my Twitch account, so uh, I have a lot to learn. So uh, yeah, I'm really struggling to get to uh, a thousand subscribers, and I need four thousand view hours to be able to monetize my channel. I know that when I reach that, if I reach that, I am going to reach it sooner or later. But I know that when I reach that, I'm not going to be making tons of money. It's only going to be like a couple of dollars. But uh, that's not the point. Uh, I'm not doing this to make money. I'm When I finally get uh, the ability to monetize my channel, it's going to give me a little extra. I'm going to feel better with myself because I, I know that I've, I've achieved something. So... Uh, my big goal right now is to get my channel monetized and yeah it sounds stupid probably but uh, it's not to to earn money i'm not going to make a lot of money using uh, or making videos on youtube there are people who do make money but uh, i'm just one dude fel <coughs> filming on his iphone so uh, i don't really have any expectations of uh, turning into a it's Peter Pan. Case nice that or anything like that. So uh, I just want I just want the the channel to get monetized, <clears throat> and I just want even a dollar, a check for the dollar into my account, and I'll be super happy, because then uh, I would feel that I've reached a big big milestone. Uh, I started the channel in. I can't remember if it was September or something last year. So going from zero with no networking and no connections on YouTube to going to, it says 117 subscribers now. No! My first uh, YouTube subscriber stream campaign. Uh, I think that's pretty good. He's beginning to believe. But I have done a lot of uh, internet marketing. I've I actually started in uh, in the late '90s, and uh, I got a few uh, free stuff uh, back then. I was doing marketing for different companies, 
one of them was a hosting company and uh, I got free hosting uh, stuff like that so and I did uh, I did go to a uh, market and media school uh, when I was younger so I know a little bit I'm no expert I'm not saying that but I do know the basics and uh, I've also been learning a lot uh, uh, there wasn't any YouTube or actually there wasn't in even uh, any uh, big internet thing uh, when I went to the market and media school but uh, then everything was the billboards and uh, and uh, phones and stuff like that but don't worry I've never done phone marketing uh, never have and never will I'd rather kill myself yeah, I hate people when they call. Uh, I hate people when they call unannounced. Yeah, I hate people when they call unannounced. I prefer a text message before, especially if they're calling from uh, a number that I don't have on my uh, on my phone, and especially if they're calling from uh, from a hidden uh, hidden number, then I basically I don't pick up the phone. Usually just a creditor and uh, I don't have money for them so they can go <laughs> themselves. If I did have money I would pay everybody so that wouldn't be a problem but uh, I don't have any money and there's no point in calling me and nagging me and oh, give us some money uh, it's gonna cost you even more. I know it's gonna cost me more money. Every time, every single day the money that I owe to the creditors and shit like that it's just going up and up and up and uh, I don't have a job right now. I don't have any money to pay anybody. So I'm struggling just to get money for, for rent. And uh, we don't, we basically don't have any food. So uh, yeah, life's hard, but uh, it'll get better sometime, somehow. But it will, I'm sure of it. And I'm not expecting uh, my YouTube channel to uh, to help with that. Uh, I'm doing this uh, for myself. Um, I started off doing it because I wanted to practice uh, uh, practice video editing and uh, being in front of the camera and stuff like that. And uh, I started uh, I started the podcast uh, so that I could practice. Uh, Talking into the microphone and uh, making good audio and stuff like that, and uh, not to brag, but I think it's it's pretty good right now, and uh, that's thanks to the cheap microphone that I got. So maybe you want to see my my audio setup here. It's excuse the messy desk. I've been meaning to uh, to clean up the desk for uh, quite a while now, but I haven't. Uh, <laughs> I haven't gotten it around to it yet. Uh, anyway, I got my old uh, iMac. It's a uh, 2012 iMac uh, 17 inch. Uh, it was <clears throat> it was really slow when I got it. Uh, I traded in uh, with the old computer that I have that I had. Uh, anyway, I got the iMac that you see here. I got the audio interface. It's a Behringer Euphoria UMC 22. It's one of the cheapest uh, interface. Not the cheapest, but one of the cheapest uh, that you can get. But it's also one of the best after seeing a lot of reviews. And now I also got the... Uh, maybe you've seen the microphone already. You uh, Behringer... XM8500 It's an XLR microphone. It's connected uh, To the audio interface and uh, now I got the boom stand Connected to my desk and I got the pop filter and I got the pop filter a couple of days ago and I haven't I Haven't really tried the pop filter yet so uh, that's why I I kind of want to make another podcast uh, later tonight so I can uh, Put it to the test. And I got these uh, Sennheiser HD205. I think they're like studio or DJ headphones. They are 
really really good headphones you can uh, tilt one of the ear pieces up like this so you can have uh, one ear open really really good uh, headphones uh, the top part here was starting to fall apart so i had to yeah i've actually sewn something look i can sew <laughs> This was actually a piece of a t-shirt that I cut off. And it's starting to split already. Yeah, anyway. So I was getting like a tiny, it's like, it's like fake leather. And uh, when it gets dry and uh, brittle and crumples up and uh, I started to getting little black dots in my hair. And I noticed that it's coming from the, the cushioning. Uh, <laughs> On my headphones so i just took a t-shirt to cut it up and uh, put that on there uh, sewed it on i tried using a sewing machine but <laughs> it didn't work out i can't use a sewing machine so i just uh, found a needle and thread and uh, sewed it on with my hand so uh, doesn't look good but uh, it works that's the important part <laughs> so anyway i'm rambling again i've recorded for Oh, this was just going to be like a five minute, uh, damn, am I really a babbler, rambler, whatever you want to call it? Um, I've ordered a uh, tripod, uh, uh, I found a tripod on eBay. What was it cost? What did it cost? I think it was like $15 or $20 or something. Um... Yeah, I don't have any money, but uh, I really needed a tripod because I can't use I can't use this tripod uh, for my camera rig because uh, it's not built for. Um, this is a photo camera tripod, and it's not built for uh, video. So you can see uh, now I only have the light on top, but uh, when I have that filming rig on top of it, it's just gonna droop down like this so it's it's no good so i had to get another one and uh, i found the cheapest one i had because i uh, yeah i got the uh, the fluid head uh, the tripod uh, head mount thing here it's aluminum it's really really good it's it's a cheap chinese thing but uh the quality seems pretty good for what it cost. I can't remember what it cost, like $20, $25, something. It was just under the import tax limit uh, to Norway. So uh, so with the head and the tripod, I'm probably up to, up to about $50 or something for the whole thing. Uh, it's a lot of money when you don't have money, but uh, I needed it and uh, yeah. Just gonna have to make do without uh, that money but when i get that set up uh, i can use my uh, microphone and i can do uh, podcasting and video together so i don't have to uh, to make one video for youtube and one uh, one uh, recording for a podcast i'm hoping that i can just uh, do a video and record take audio from the video recording and uh, yeah, use that as a, as a podcast, then I can two flies in one swat. Yeah, that's what they say in Norway anyway. Two fluer and smack. Yeah, buddy. Anyway, I'm gonna drink some coffee. Uh, I haven't poured it in the cup yet, but uh, at least my uh, my Twitch stream is uh, live. It's been going for. Uh, uh, it's been going for 16 hours and almost 30 minutes now. So yeah, my uh, you can see my uh, YouTube uh, address here. And my uh, my Twitch address is uh, twitch.tv slash uh, uh, Trevor76. It's... Uh, T R three V zero R seven six. So it's basically seventy six and it's Robert backwards, but I replaced uh, the E with an with a three and D O with a zero. So 
I was just trying to figure out the uh, username that nobody had, so uh, that's what I got. So I'm just gonna roll with it. Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna drink some coffee and uh, do a quick edit later on. Uh, I've been recording uh, way longer than I was expecting uh, that I was supposed to, but uh, thanks for watching and uh, remember to uh, like and subscribe. And uh, if you haven't, uh, if you have liked and subscribed, uh, remember to uh, share the link. <laughs> Just share it out, uh, share the link with your friends and family and uh